Hi, I'm Charlie Kasov. I'm a math teacher, and today we're going to learn the difference between gross square feet and net square feet. Now, let's think of the bottom of a building, the basic floor of a building, and say it's 20 feet long by 30 feet wide. Now, gross square feet is the measurement of the entire inside space of a building. So it doesn't matter how wide the walls are on the outside, we have 20 feet inside by 30 feet, which gives us 600 gross square feet. Now net square feet is the gross square feet minus certain things like hallways and elevator shafts and stairwells and any other large piece of machinery that takes up space in the building. So let's say we have a hallway that's 12 by 2, we have a elevator shaft that's 3 by 3, and a stairwell that's 8 by 7. So to get net square feet, we're going to take 600 and we're going to subtract 3 by 3, which is 9, 8 by 7, which is 56, and 12 by 2, which is 24, which will leave us with 511 net square feet. So if you are trying to figure something out with your floor plan, you may have more uh, than just three things to subtract from. But because I had three uh, obstacles or things inside the building, uh, I subtracted three times. If you have six, subtract six times. So I'm Charlie Kasov, and you just learned the difference between gross square feet and net square feet. Thanks a lot.